Once again, here I go, writing bars in my Evernote. Tears on my fingertips, shouldn't I be over this? Started questioning when you asked if I'm over it. If I could, I'd rip the band aid, get it over with. I know I'd be obsessing in my mind. Might have brought it up too many times. But feelings inside not expressed Never did translate to me actually feeling fine I crossed it if that's the line I values just ain't aligned What's the purpose of holding on? I'm the only one that's been trying I got way more clocks than I got time I got way more baggage than I got eyes That he's been building But I got degrees in concealing Bringing them vibes around people ain't really appealing How I use ain't the place to be sharing your feelings At least that's how I be feeling I've been running this block since day one so any and everything that happens on these corners, I know about it. That's why they call me the big homie around here. Alright baby, talk to me. Tell me how you really feel. I just think it's a little bit corny. Cool. Damn. Look, I know it's not Oscar worthy writing or anything, but I can use it as real footage. You're not getting paid for this trip? I thought you said this was I know, I know, okay? But it's just something about this that feels like a good opportunity. A good opportunity? Yes. Mm, like the time we drove to Atlanta for the director to ghost us? That type of opportunity, Trey? Look, that man said he had a medical emergency. Nigga, you almost had a medical emergency. I took off a work to drive us down there. Yeah. Look, baby. I have to take chances. If I don't, how do you expect for anything to change? These chances come with consequences if they don't work out, Trey. I'm working overtime to keep us afloat. I could use some help. Trey, um... Nah, it's... <laughs> it's cool. It's cool. I'll just call you when I finish up. Sick and tired of wasting time and wasting time on nothing. The only time she switch up on me is switching the subject. Man, I'm sick and tired of wasting time. Let's get into something. All my dogs is with me, man, and all these chicks they love me. Yeah, I think we're wasting. Well, isn't this a surprise? And how are you, Nia? I'm good. It's been, what, five, six months? How are you? You know, keeping my head down and trying to get things done. But I'm good. Mm -hmm. So to what do I owe the pleasure? Damn, I can't check on a friend. It's never just checking up with you, Trey. The last conversation we had wasn't exactly a good one, and I'm not in a space where I need- Nia, Nia, Nia. Listen. In my personal relationship, interfere with the work. And it messed up everything we were trying to build. Look, if I could take it back, I would. Okay, Trey. So what do you want? Look, I've been striking out on a lot of opportunities lately, and I need some advice. Like that Atlanta gig where the director left you high and dry? I swear nobody will forget about that. That happened? Yeah. Um, can you hear me out? Okay, all right, I'm listening. Look, I'm starting to get my love for acting back. You know, just like when we were in college. We used to sleep and eat theater. Remember that? Yeah, we were kids then. Nowadays, it's not really about talent. You know, people just want a certain look. And even with my skills, I still can't land the job that I really want. They all call for fair skin and a fat ass. Yeah, and that's why we should change the narrative. Like, it's enough being a black woman in America. The last thing I need is to be constantly reminded that I don't look like an IG model. Same old Nia. So, I'm on my way to film this small project. I like the script, and I feel like I can really make this character mine. But? But it's a no-budget film and a first-time director. I mean, that's not necessarily a bad thing, but at some point you do want to be selective about the projects you take on, Trey. Yeah. I mean, I like his energy, though, and he's shooting it with a red camera, so if anything, a brother can use it for his real. <laughs> okay, so they can budget for a red camera, but they can't pay their cast, and that's not a red flag to you? Yeah, um, my Uber's here. I'll uh, give you a call and we can catch up later. 
All right, talk to you in six months. You don't do me like that. It's getting dark Demons trying to take my heart It's getting spooky in the dark Please don't leave me in the dark Now listen Got no time for mistakes, so stick to the plan If I could, then I would go do it again It's getting dark Please don't leave me in the dark Hey, how you doing? My name is uh, Trey Austin. Looking for Jordan Reels. He's a film director. Trey, our star. <laughs> nice to meet you, man. Break it down. Nice to meet you too, <laughs> man. <laughs> yeah, um, so, am I early? I know call time is 11 a.m. Oh, no, 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 no. You're on time, man. Actually, we're ready to shoot. Where's uh, everybody else? Camera, cast, the crew? The crew is I, the cast is you, my man. Didn't you read the script? Yeah, I read the script. And they had multiple characters. And you play all of them, my man? Even the white girl? Range, my brother. Range. We gotta get started from the top. I'll get the camera ready. Hold on one second for you. It's not as bad as it looks. It's not as bad as it looks. It's not as bad as it looks. Not as bad as it looks. Jordan, that, 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 that's an iPhone. You said we were shooting with a red camera. Uh, couple budget cuts, man. See, see, the iPhone's just as good. Uh, I got big plans for you, Trey. See, 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 see. Hoodie Boy 1 is just the start of the trilogy. All right? I'm trying to get my own cinematic universe. You be my candy cabolo. I'm gonna take this to the top, and I got a vision for it. I promise, I promise. Oh, I forgot the blonde wig in my bag for the Marvel scenes, but <laughs> we'll get to that later. You ready to shoot? <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie, bro. Kinda wanna see you play a white girl now. Man, how do I keep ending up in shit like this? Like, the last thing I need is a I told you so speech from Sky. <laughs> Damn, with an iPhone, though? iPhone. <sighs> Man, don't even trip. Hey, I'm about to fire this up. Mm, gotta get your mind off it somehow. That's the last thing I need right now. More for me then. Hey, uh, you got something sweet in here to eat? Sweet? Hey, who who I look like to you, huh? The candy lady? Take your ass up there and you'll find out. Hey, when the last time you've been grocery shopping? Places like you just moved in. What? What? I'm a gangster. Gangsters do not cook, all right? That's why they invented DoorDash. Gangster, huh? You don't even got a pack of noodles in here. I got standards. Anyway, man. How you think Sky gonna take it? Maybe you should rethink your career. Things take time, but we got bills now. Same shit. Yeah, that sounds about like Sky. Sounds about right. <laughs> What you eating on, bro? <clears throat> Just some gummy bears. Oh, hold up. Man, relax. I only had a few. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. 
Oh, damn. <laughs> What's funny? <laughs> Nigga, those little TAC gummies, man. You, you about to be high as fuck. Uh, damn. <laughs> you better off hitting this blunt. <laughs> Sit down, man. You might as well go ahead and ride this out, man. <laughs> you be all right. <laughs> Me and Nia used to do these in college all the time. <laughs> same shit. Same shit. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> <laughs> you took way too many, bro. Just do me a favor, all right? Just keep your clothes on because I ain't trying to see you like that. Nigga, what? All right, my homeboy KD from the east side, he took like about four of them bags. Next thing you know, he's running around, butterball naked, just in his underwear. Yeah, and I'm feeling on himself, Tumbo. <gasps> they coming, they coming. <laughs> Fucking fried as them. <laughs> oh boy, you were something else. <clears throat> hey, I got a piss. M mama, no. Is anybody else in here? Yo, I gotta pee. I'ma just be in there a minute. You can get it right back. I don't want to hear a trade. You always have an excuse. You're sorry about this. It was, it was a big opportunity. Everything is a big opportunity to you, Trey. But where's the money? I need the money now. We need food in our fridge now, Trey. Come on, man. You sitting out here playing actor while carrying this whole household on my back, Trey. On my back. I didn't sign up for this. You said that we were going to be in this together. Together, Trey. I'm alone in this. Come on, man. Get it together. It's over. There's no Oscar in the living room. It's not going to happen. If it hasn't happened now, it's never going to happen. Get it in your head, okay? Let's go get something to eat. I'm starving. <sighs> Work was an absolute mess. This guy was snoring and farting the entire flight. We went through like six cans of Febreze. Anyways, how'd the shoe go? <laughs> Cherry? Thanks, babe. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Looks like you had a pretty eventful day. Is it that obvious? You want to talk about it? Nah. I honestly rather forget about it. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Am I a clown? What do you mean? I don't know. I mean, you bust your ass every day while I'm out here trying to play actor. Like, 
I need to step up. Well, I didn't mean to give you such a hard time earlier. I understand that these things take time. I guess I just got a bit frustrated and I took it out on you. Truth is, I'm really proud of you for continuing to chase your dreams. Really? Yeah. Kind of makes me wish I did the same. I mean, I didn't say I want to be a flight attendant growing up, but here I am. Baby, I really appreciate that. That means a lot coming from you. Well, I do think I look good on the red carpet, though. Uh, definitely. <laughs> a lot better than you did, all balled up in the shower looking like a crackhead. <laughs> man, no, move. See, I'm that's, kidding. I'm that's kidding. why I'm about to go to bed, man. You play too much, yo. Like, I really thought it was candy. Like, that's why I told you to stop eating at everybody's house. I ain't slept good in like 30 some days. Hey, time I lift the pen of stress on the page. When the peace come, I just pray that it stays. Just another chick that's living through her mistakes. I do it all on the stage. Just look at me in my face. Eyes are the windows, the feelings that's in the safe. Panted my emotions, not all of them well behaved. But shouldn't I get a medal for making sure they was raised? All the stuff that I'm giving, I pray to God that it pays. Here, yeah, kitty, kitty, my spirit, it like straight. Probably cause I wonder when I bow my head to pray. But the Lord, like the cops, don't wanna see me get away all the promises my best in the moment flaws yeah i own it but the goal set high every single one is stoning it's puff no pass from the pm to the moment it's me versus me i don't see another opponent wrote these bars in the late night in other words another day i ain't ate right but i'm full now what a heck of a workout time to cool down what a heck of a flow who brought the pool round bankrupt size mean j and the crew one in the chamber mean k in the booth circle so small might invest in the coupe now you need a ride what you want me to do I'm a product of what I've been through. God is present when I be sinful. All that dirt that he got, he ain't planted. That's one way that he different than cops. I feel different a lot. Spit like I starve, but this piss in the pot.